hello welcome to tyronet so in this tutorial in fact i'm going to make things so easier for some people okay so in this tutorial what i'm going to do is that i'm going to take you through how to send a book sms with your company name or your brand name to so many people without your telephone number okay it's very simple easy and then convenient okay so without wasting much time you are going to use um, a system okay the, the name of the system is Akasel. okay so I will give you the link in my YouTube description okay so let's go to Akasel. so you go to Akasel user registration all right so this is the first page that you need to receive okay I already have an account here but for the purpose or for you to understand I am going to create a new account as well okay so here we are required to fill in our details so i will say um tyron okay let me say quasi tyron is it tyron then i'll say um i want to use my school name okay so holy gabriel that's the school i teach holy gabriel anglican school okay at gmail.com then i will input my phone number five five six five seven eight five five nine then i'll create a password okay then you confirm your password okay so you agree to the terms and condition then you tick to check if you are not a robot okay so they will ask you to select so you just select it uh, for them to know that you are not a robot okay so you sign up all right so you see i told you because this my this my number is already existing in the system so let me change it five 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 thirty two forty six one seven if this one too is existing then <laughs> I need to go for a new number. Okay. Oh, it's before. All right. Oh, this number two is existing. Wow. Then which number am I going to use now? Okay. So that means I have to go back and then log in. Okay. Because I have an account already. So if you are new this is how it will appear to you so you just have to fill in the details okay i have two numbers they say i've used all so i need to log in so that you will take it from there okay so i have logged in as um tyron okay um yeah that's tyron it all right so if you log in this is the first home page that you are going to see okay so we have the book sms we have the USSD, we have the email marketing, we have the voice SMS. Today we are going to focus on the book SMS. So click on the book SMS. It will take you to a new home page. All right. Then you go to your dashboard. Okay. So they said, welcome to Akasal SMS platform. Next. Uh, they will take you through some tutorials. You just skip, 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 skip. All right. Now, when you come to your dashboard, we have when you click on your dashboard you should see the history of messages that you've sent okay so since i've not done any of that um let's move on okay now when you register by default here you will see that sms balance will be 10. so by default when you register you have an opportunity to send 10 sms to people okay it doesn't matter the data you are going to use now after you are done using that 10 you can only send messages to people if you recharge and this one we don't recharge with our normal sms bundle okay we buy it online so let's look at how to recharge your account so you go to recharge okay now we have purchase sms plan then we have balance top up okay so we'll go to the purchase sms plan now when you click on that you are going to see the plan here when you buy 10 cds you'll be able to send 385 messages to people that means individual people 
when we talk about the people you are talking about okay let me say you'll be able to send 385 sms a day or to any i don't i don't know so it's a spice okay so until the 385 messages are sent that doesn't expire okay so let's say you have you are a susu collector you are a school administrator and you want to remind parents of their ward school fees or whatever okay maybe there's a pta meeting coming up you want to broadcast a message to them okay maybe you are you like yeah if you are into business or something like that so what you have to do is that if you are buying the 200 cities that means you are going to send 800 messages so let's say you have about 20 clients okay if you want to send message so when you send one message to all the clients that means 20 will be taken from the 800 and 800 which will be left with 720 in that order okay so after you are done with the one you want to buy so there are lots of them now you click on view features okay so they have the price here we have the network here then we have the number of messages that you can send so if you want to buy click on purchase now i mostly prefer you going for the pay stack the pay stack is much convenient and easy okay so when you click on pay stack that's the payment option we have the pay stack we have the express pay but the pay stack is much convenient so click on pay stack go to purchase now okay so let's wait for it to load now after it has loaded you will see this um interface okay so that's those who are using the credit card but if you are not using credit card you go in for your mobile money so you click on mobile money here then you enter your mobile money number that you want to buy from so i want to buy from this is my mobile money number zero five five six five seven eight five five nine good immediately you input it the system details whether it's mtn or whatever or whatever now when you click confirm they will send you an sms okay a message or a, a number that you use you will enter it and then so let's click on confirm now watch here you will see that there will be a notification an sms will be sent to me because i've linked my phone with my whatsapp uh, my laptop so enter 7094922 to pay 10 cities to akasel do not share with anyone kindly ignore if you didn't hesitate this transaction okay so if i really want to continue i just have to copy it put it there then factorize when i'm done it will pop up on my mobile phone and then i will input my password and i'll be able to buy that airtime okay so since i'm not ready to buy i'll just dismiss it good so this is how you are you will be able to top up your account all right so let's go back i'm not interested in that now after you are done um uh, buying your uh, what's the name uh, recharging your account or topping up your account then now go to your sms so we have quick sms we have bulk sms now the quick sms might maybe be one person but a bulk sms might be like two people okay so i'll click on bulk sms now when i click on bulk sms I have to go to recipient okay if only i have numbers stored in there so let's let me teach you something here so go to contact now we have add contact okay so that's your phone book okay so if you want to add contact um, let me delete these ones that i did earlier on okay so over here if i want to add contact i'll just go in here okay then type the person's name so i'll say tyron okay then i'll click on add um sorry so i'll go to add now when i add tyron tyron will show up on my um uh, phone book okay so I'll, I'll go to action so when you click on action you'll be able to edit it and add the contact or view the contact or whatever okay then over here we have import contact so this one you can create it 
with maybe um, Excel. So when you click over here, when you create it on Excel, you'll be able to export your, or sorry, you'll be able to import your contact. Okay, so you click here, then you go to your phone library or whatever. Okay, then you'll be able to import it. Okay, good. So if that is, if you don't want to be typing all the contact and getting tired, that's what you do. So let me go back. So over here, I have add another contact. Okay, so I'll add the telephone number 055657855 nine then my customer name is called tyron his last name is called kwesi his email okay let me not worry myself i just have to save it okay so i have one contact here that belongs to tyron it if i want to add another contact to i go to add i i add another one five 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 thirty two forty six one seven then i'll say this one is called Emmanuel, then is this one is Amankwa. Okay, so I'll click on save. So I have two contacts now. So now I can do my bulk SMS. Okay, that is if you want to do bulk SMS. Now, when you are done, close it, close this one too, then come to SMS. When you go to SMS, click on bulk SMS. Okay. Now you select the people you want to send a message to. So I'll select Tyron. I'll select Tyron. Okay. Now I've selected Tyron. Now the sender ID, the name of your institution will come here. So let's say this is from Holy Gabriel. But because it shouldn't exceed 11 characters, you have to make sure that maybe you can use the acronym of your company if the company is very long. Okay. But if it is not long, you can... Maybe your school, the name of your school is very long. Okay, the name of my school is very long. Holy Gibra Anglican School Complex. So I'll shorten it. And I'll be it. Holy Gasco. Holy Gasco. So from Holy Gasco. Okay. Then I'll say. Um, company. All right. So. I'll say. Please. Be reminded that we have a PTA meeting coming Saturday. So maybe I'm sending, I'm, I'm doing it maybe as a parent. So I'm sending it to a parent, okay? Please be reminded that we have a PTA meeting coming Saturday at the school's premises at exactly 9 a.m. We hope to see you there from I'll say management management um, of holy holy gabriel anglican school from management of holy uh, from management of holy gabriel anglican school now one thing you should know about uh, akasa is that it doesn't matter uh, uh, how um, bulky, uh, how lengthy the message is, it doesn't matter. Okay, even if it is 3,000 words, all it matters is that when you send that 3,000 words, they did that only one SMS from the this thing you buy. Okay, so this is the message I want to send to Mr. Tyron. Okay, so I will input the recipient here again if only I want to. Okay, so total number of re recipients will appear here, they are only two. Are you getting me? Okay. So now let's send it and see. It will take a while, maybe either two to three minutes. So let's send it and then let's hold on. You will see the notification appearing here. Send. So let me click on send. Now they said your file has been processed successfully. Okay. So let's see what happens.